All right, in this video, we're gonna show you how to countersink a drilled hole. All right, once you've got your holes drilled, what you wanna do is you wanna countersink it so that your screw head sits nice and flush with the wood. And you're gonna need a bit like this to do that. And what that's gonna do, it's gonna give me this nice little wide area here where my, the head of my screw will fit in. So let's go ahead and put her in, put her into our drill, tighten her down. And all you do is just come in here like this, and you're just going to, till you get a nice, see how it flares it out? Watch. And then depending how big your, and then depending how big your screw head is, depend how deep you're going to go. I'm going to get in there pretty good when these so you guys can see. Yeah. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and blow this off and then I'll come back and show it to you. All right, so here it is. You can see how nice and clean it is. And then this one's a little off a little bit. You want it to have it, try to get it as circular as possible. That one end of the screw will come out here, and then your screw will lie flat right there. And you just gotta make sure that your interior is big enough for your screw to fit through. And then the head should smush right in there. But it's, it, you can see that I moved it a little bit too much to this side. I need to really kind of square it out this side a little bit. There we go. And do the same on this. So you see I turned it a little bit to the side and it kind of will work that side. So you can get a little bit better, you know, more round. There we go. And that gives you your nice uh, thing. And now you can put your screws in there. This is not the screw I'm using, but I just want so you guys can see how it fits. So it'll go in and you can see the head goes right there. And then later, if you wanted to cover that up, you know, with uh, something you could. And uh, that way it's flush with the board. Otherwise you get your screws to head sticking out. This way you don't. So that's why you do it. Of course, this isn't the one I'm gonna use, but I'm just showing, you know, so you guys can see, you know, what you can do with it. Just like that. And that's it, really. And that'll give you a nice, good finish. All right, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos where I show you how to use stuff like this right here. Peace out.